only dude here. So, I was on my way to the school this morning, and just before I got to the school, I noticed the truck acted different. It made a little bit of a weird sound. I mean, I was pulling into the school at the time. Well, come to find out, I think the alternator is bad. So, you can see there's no voltage whatsoever. And I keep getting a battery light. I don't think you can see it because of the sun. Let's see if I can zoom in here. If I accelerate, sometimes it'll come on. But no voltage. So I'm headed over to AutoZone. Gotta get me a new alternator. Get it done quickly so that I could get back to work and get around. I know I'm gonna need a starter for this next. I still haven't even got the uh, lights put on this thing yet. That's on a video that's gonna come at some point in time. So, off to AutoZone. You can tell that it's running on the battery, especially when you turn your turn signal on, watch. Just see the gauge flipping. <laughs> Every time I put the turn signal on, that's funny. All right, I'm here at AutoZone. So I'm going to take this battery off first and then uh, work on getting the uh, alternator pulled out real quick so I can just take it right in, get the cord, don't have to get charged or anything for it. And it's just a couple bolts. Alternator is really easy to change. Alright, bolt number one. Let's 
see here. Let's, let's take this one too. It does, but I'm not using the deep socket again. Let's get 13 over here. Number two. Now we're gonna change out our socket to the big one. Get rid of that last one off here. Get inside of it. Oh, that's an awkward spot. I have to go. extension here. Let's see if I can get around that thing there. Yeah, that'll work. I think next time I'll make sure I take this one last. I'm probably making it a little a little harder on myself has to be uh, let's see here just turn it nope I'm gonna have to keep doing it this way okay uh, spin it all the way out there it comes okay Cut her out, I'm gonna take it in, maybe have them even test it, make sure it is bad, and then uh, get a new one, put it back on, we're good to go. We got the new alternator, so I'll take all the pieces and parts off of here that I don't need. That can cross the side and throw that away shortly. Alright, slip her back in exactly the same way she came out. on myself this time I put these other bolts in first that one on I've ever owned. But this is why I like owning older vehicles because it's just really easy. Get in here and swap it out pretty quickly. Torque. All right. Back over here. Tighten this sucker up. Torque. All right. Now, done with that. That. I'm gonna use this. Alright, now we get in here. Turn and turn and turn and turn.
click, click, torque. Okay, we're good there. All the is back on. I had to get everything else put back on. lock nut will fit on here. Will it fit on there? I'm going to use the lock nut. <laughs> it was on it last time. So I'll just reuse that. Instead of shiny new one that comes with it. Alright, that's on. And then we should be able to pop that on there. Yep, that protects that. We got this plug to plug in. Boom that on there and then last but not least let's get the belt on uh, let's see here this came from where is the 10 like right back there right, slide this, this a little bit now let's put back on here on track everything looks good there now last thing I'm gonna go through this stuff away real quick all right I just got to put the battery back on the negative That's it, ladies and gentlemen. Close this up. All right, get you in here and show you what I've done. New alternator is in, belt's on, plugs are all there, bolts are all tightened down. And then I came over and I took the negative, turn them all off and put it back on. So now I'm gonna go start it up, see what it does. Here we go, start her up. See if we get some voltage. Hey, look at that. Voltage back. Come out here and show you. See it working. Working real good. It's gonna whine for a little bit just because uh, it's gotta recharge that battery. But good to go. And that's it. All done. It only took me all in all together. I think it took longer to get it out than it did to put it back in. Um, but back on the road, don't have to worry about the, the truck breaking down on my way in uh, to home tonight. I'm good to go. So thanks for watching. Make sure to hit the subscribe button if you're not a subscriber already. And then hit the like button to let me know that you like this video. And uh, the bell icon. If you hit that bell icon, then you'll know when I've got new, uh, new videos that I've uploaded. So... Again, thanks for watching. We'll catch you on the next one.